I am Melissa Birch, and this is homeopathyhealsyou.us, blog for people interested in natural health. So this is a blog to really start to understand how you can use homeopathy, how it can really change your life. And I thought I would start with something really fun today. And as some of you might know, if you've been to a homeopath or you've been to any kind of therapy or you've been to, I don't know, even some self-improvement type workshops, there is a self-reflection. And in homeopathy, this is a very important piece of understanding yourself, understanding the homeopath has to understand you at this deepest level. What is the total state? What is it that connects your chief complaint, whether it's migraines or ear infection or colitis, whatever is bothering you with this deeper state. So I thought what would be fun today is to actually give you a technique where you could start to take your own case, not to prescribe a homeopathic remedy, but to start to understand this deeper state. So the way it works is you would need to get some paper. It's a journal exercise. And you would write at the top of the paper, it's better to do it handwritten rather than typing, but if you're somebody who has to type, that's okay. And what you're going to do is you're going to write down what your chief complaint is. What is the problem that is bothering you the most in your life? Maybe it's a health problem, maybe it's an emotional problem, maybe it's a mental problem, could even be a spiritual problem. And so you write this problem out at the top, and then what you're going to do is write as, you know, just kind of fluid, as flowing as you can. You'll start to write what comes to mind around this problem, okay? And you don't want to censor it. You don't really want to pick up your pen. Doesn't matter about spelling or punctuation or grammar or anything. You just want to get into the flow of writing. And you just keep writing. And at some point, you're going to come to a pause. And at this pause, you're going to ask yourself this question. What do I mean by? And you'll pick the word or phrase that has the most charge in what you just wrote. And then this will kind of propel you forward and you'll write again, not really just letting it come out. Don't think about it. Don't, you know, just freehand write. And then again, you'll come to a pause and you'll ask the same question. What do I mean by? And then you'll fill in the blank with something you've just written that has some energy, some intensity, or strange, just, you know, pops out of what you just wrote. And you'll keep doing this. And I would put a timer, like, you know, use 15 minutes. Okay, and then what I'm going to do in the next blog is tell you how you can actually analyze this from a homeopathic viewpoint. So what is getting uncovered from this exercise is sort of deeper and deeper ways that you understand the state. For example, let's say I said my problem was, you know, I have this itchy skin. Okay, and then I just start writing about the itchy skin, how it bothers me, how it affects my day, how I hate to have somebody see it, and how when I take a, a hot shower, it makes it worse, but if I run it under cold water, it feels better, even ice makes it feel better, and then it makes me think of this dream I had where, you know, there was this chasing going on, and I couldn't get away, and it's kind of like my itchy skin, I can't get away from it. So you see the idea, you just kind of free flow, and you start to see that there's a lot of layers here around this problem in this free-flowing uh, expression that you're doing in your journal.